for, uh, well, it was in the 1990s they did. Oh, okay. Yeah, they came over here with uh, the stars for uh, uh, Night of the Hunter. Oh, wow. And we've been on a registry ever since. And when one of the producers say, I'm looking for this kind of a location, all the yeah. scouts know about this place. Uh, they go, I know where to go. So <laughs> come over here, take yeah. a picture. Or hold about 25,000 pictures. Oh, wow. Yeah. And take it back to the producer and says, look what we got. And he says, I like that one. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, that is awesome. He said it's haunted and we can use the equipment is in there. really? Yeah. Oh my God. I can bring it up there. See, the, a doctor built this house and he was the only country doctor around. Uh -huh. So, of course, he had patients. Some didn't make it, some did. Right. Wow. wow. Awesome. All right, I'm going to go grab the equipment. All right. So, right now, I'm going to get the REM pad and the EMF meter because that's all I brought. But it's better than nothing. Yeah. She does, she does all the paranormal. Yeah. These are beautiful. Won't be long. Woo. So pretty. Oh. Of course, they didn't do any of the inside scenes. Uh huh. They didn't. Here. No, the inside of my house is nothing but to do with the country. Okay. So they just yes, did the outside. Right. But it is over 100 years old. Right. Well, it looks haunted. So, I mean, it probably has. <laughs> well, like I said, well, the doctor built all those kids around about the. Uh, the children, the children hiding yeah. all your tools and shit. Yeah. And then three or four days later, he'll find them. I oh, really? Right. Yeah. I have a spirit that does that. Oh my God. Drives me nuts. They think it's funny. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> well, I mean, this property goes from here to the road. Oh, okay. And there's camps and log cabins, and they use that for Sleepy Hollow. Oh, really? <laughs> You're at the Conjuring House. This is crazy. So he was saying none of none of the movie was filmed inside, just the outside. And he said that the backyard looks exactly like it did in the movie. So I can't wait to show you guys. Oh, yeah. This is such a pretty land. Man, you guys just have a little slice of heaven out here. They had the scene where the bird flew into the window and fell down while he was going through his truck. Which and window was it? Oh, uh, that window right there. Okay. And then they had to come over there and try to uh, get the bird where it flops around. Uh-huh. Well, they had trouble doing that because you know how you have a puppet with the stick yeah. and strings? They tried doing that. They tried doing all kinds of things to make it look like that. This is cool. And that, that's crazy. The water really is back there. Oh, yeah. Man, do you have the, is there a dock out there like they showed? Well, kind of, it used to be. Okay. Remember that scene where the sheet flew up to the window and yeah. it fell back down? That uh, Ichabod, I mean, uh, the Sheba was standing back there. Oh, yeah. The Sheba the witch. Yeah. Yeah, I'm standing up there talking to him because the person who played the witch is a dude. So I'm sitting there talking to him and then James says, quiet on the set. I got to back up in the corner and be real quiet and real still. I really yeah, and they say, cut, and then we sit there and talk some more. They shot that scene like six times. Same thing where they had Sadie with dead right there where them flowers are. And they had that poor little girl run out here and see her dead dog and start screaming. Yeah. And she had to do that six or eight times. Wow. They were constantly reshooting, reshooting, reshooting. But like I said, that flood came in and it was this deep right here. Show everybody. How deep was it? This deep. That's crazy. That's so did flood. it damage the inside yes, first this floor? Was the first flood. Uh, first flood? The first flood was this deep. Oh my gosh. So I went and redone everything. Got new appliances in the kitchen, new stuff in the house. Two years later, here comes Florence. I had six feet of water in that house. Oh no. Yeah, I had to live up there on top. Until the water went away. So, how, how did you get it restored now? I'm not. I can't afford it now. Oh, Damn. that's it horrible. Broke. I'm sorry. Yeah, that one destroyed the hell out of me. It's cool. Swing. Well, they built that tree right here. 
Oh, so it was a fake tree? Yeah, it was a fake tree. They built it. Oh my goodness. It took, it took a, a group of four artists to put it together. It took them a month to do it. Wow. But, man, That's was, crazy. I thought it was a real tree. No, no, no. no. Ain't nothing like that real. <laughs> and yeah. there's what's left of the dock. Yeah. You guys can see the dock. The conjuring tree in the movie was built. He said it took a couple of months. I think he said three months by different artists. And that's the base of the tree right there. That's cool. I wonder why they tore the tree apart. They should have just left it. Well, that was a liability issue. Oh. So we see all kinds of things. Yeah, that was part, that was part of the movie. Now the Oh, look at the deer head. <laughs> That's funny. How did you get that up there? A ladder? I'm going the roots of the conjuring tree right here. Oh my gosh. That's a cool. Yeah, they put the, like I said, yeah, that was one of the roots was flat down here because it sat on the ground. They yeah. They plopped that down and they took their fingers uh, and their tools they acting and they made it look uh, like I mean, this. Got, That's right neat. Through, I mean, like, yeah. So like I said, it's been this deep in water. Wow. That's how much water was in this house. Okay. Wow, it stays nice and cool in here. It, yeah, in the summertime it does. That's because of the way they built it. Yeah. They built the front door here, the back door there. They have this transom over here, and the air goes upstairs. Yeah. I used to live in a plantation house my first marriage, and the house stayed really cool. I never needed air conditioning. Well, we needed air conditioning because I tell you. You did? Oh, oh I never degrees, needed it. Yeah. When it gets to 100 degrees, yeah, you got to have air conditioning in there. This is nice. You got a little piece of heaven, sir. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I have an event here on the 7th that uh, they're going to sit up in here and they're going to watch The Conjuring. Oh, uh, okay. You know what you did last summer. Uh-huh. And the other spooky movies that they like. Very cool. That's a good idea. The yeah. whole movie thing. Oh, yeah. What's the quarter stairs? Yeah. Okay. So but uh, Russell, you said the water got up six feet deep. Cutter. He's the Ghostbuster. Yeah, so anyway, there you got you another view of the, the roof up top through. It's like, you know, yeah. around and around and around. This and around. is freaking huge. And then you have the bedrooms up here with fireplaces as well. Wow, it's a freaking. It's not bad uh, up here. This is way. so big. Yeah, I guess this is their mess. Ooh, of feel how cold it is now, in here. Oh, it's cold. Yeah, Compared to the rest. Well, I'm just trying to tell you, it gets cold. Yeah. Ten degrees cold. Right. Stucco ceilings, slat walls, old. Everything's old. Yeah, there we go. Back porch. I love the back porch. Hey guys, if you've been enjoying today's video, now would be the time to hit the like button, subscribe button, tap the notification bell so that you can get notified when we post videos weekly. We also love your comments. As always, stay creepy. Yeah, come out here in the mornings and have some coffee. Yeah. Right? Yeah. The wisteria. This is cool.
Very, very cool. Now you can see why he had to stay on the second floor. Yep, absolutely. I mean, he wouldn't leave, though. I don't blame him. Honestly. And if you got a boat. His mama lived here as long, almost as long as he did. And of course, the last flood, that was the last draw for her. She was like, I'm moving to Burgall. So she did. Bought a house. You want a house? Yeah. This is a this is a very amazing place. It is cool here. Oh wow, this is my favorite room. Yeah, mine too. Yours too? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like this. I spent many times sitting in that chair right there, reading a book up here. On top of the world. Yeah. So where, when you're in here, do, first of all, you have a room that's extremely cold. Um. I don't know if it's because there's a door entering to the outside, but to me, that's where I it would say something's kind of paranormal going on. Because it's like 10 degrees difference. Well, what we usually do is we set this up here and we leave it there and if it moves on its own and I mean it might be two hours, it might be two days. Right, yeah, but it does move? It does move. Crazy. And these paintings here, I don't know what they are. This is cool. Okay. Who did? Who made this walrus? My sister. That is me. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. that, was, that was her first class project. Wow, she did freaking good, man. So she brought it up here. That's cool. She's an artist. Yeah, she is. Now she makes salsa. <laughs> Does she really? Yeah. She's got her own kitchen and everything. She goes to all the um, farmer's markets and fairs. Yeah. And all that shit. And, uh, it's raw. Rachel Ann Willoughby is her name. And her salsa is completely raw. Nothing's cooked. It's all organic. That's cool. Yeah. I'll die here. <laughs> I would yeah, too. I for would sure. Like, I would too. Yeah, I'll die yeah. here. I would definitely die here. I used to have. I used to have this uh, Halloween mask that was up in them windows right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I wouldn't tell anybody about it, and they'll okay. take pictures, and then when they get home and look at the pictures, they'll open it up and they'll see that face in the window. <laughs> <laughs> Friend, I that's always fun to do. I like screwing. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's why I had the British wheel at the beginning. That's a scotch. Yeah. What is that where you would put a candle or something? Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know, it said. <laughs> Any spirits want to communicate with me? Look at this room. Phantom. What? Because you're so high up? Imagine having to clean this house. Shut, shut, shut. What did it say? Shut the door. That's what it said. Escape. 
Yeah. Yeah. What's new? What's new? Open the window. It said open the window. I'm not open. <laughs> so those weren't there, now they've appeared? Yeah, I've never seen them before. That's crazy. So you must have a little boy spirit that likes to I play, play with the toys. Girls. I got a boy and two girls. Can you tell us what? <laughs> Kathleen, she said. Okay. What's the boy's? Agree, agree, agree. She said agree. That's her name. What's the boy's name? Does the little boy want to tell us his name? We're really friendly. We just want to talk to him. I'm in love with this place. Yeah, I had some college kids that uh, were in film school. Uh -huh. That's neat. I hope they got an A. Sex, sex. He didn't even tell you? No. I do you do you know. <laughs> For real. I want to see it get restored. I would too. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I can't afford it. Recalibrating. Which battery do your camera or your camera. phone? Camera. Hey, how much battery did you have when you started? Was it low? Probably was, but go left. Go left. I want a picture of this front door right here. It said go left. Wouldn't this be a great house if you were like a kid? You know? Yeah, I would have a field day. I would do the. Wait, where is it? The, the didn't they do the clap thing here where they would clap and yeah. then hide? Yeah, yeah. Hide and go clap. Hide and go clap. Yeah, right. that would be fun. Stop, stop, stop. It gives you a shape, sign it, and responsible. Right. Look at them bees, you guys. Yes, Just destroying the wood. Go, I'm gonna go get me another battery to put my stuff in the car. There's a there's an old guy these. over here, and he's got a beard and a big hat and a black trench coat. And it's like a sailor or something. Mm -hmm. Over there? Uh, on the porch. Oh, you're talking about a spirit? Yeah. Really? Are you serious? Many people have seen him. When they come by the house and then look at the front of the house, they see him. And then they look away, and then they look back again, and he's gone. And he's wearing a trench coat? And a, and a sailor's hat, I mean, a big hat. Okay. Many people tell me they're going.